In today's video, I'm going to show you what's inside of the security tag. And this one is actually a very unusual security tag, not the one that you normally see in the stores, closed stores. As you can see, it actually consists of two parts, a big part and this small part. And there is an arrow right here. So if you push this button and turn this top lid or whatever it is called this way, that thread is actually getting all the way into this big thing. Let's see if we can do that. Okay, let's see. And there is this little light here. And also, this seems to be like some kind of a microphone. If someone will try to steal whatever this thing was on, this thing will generate the alarm and it's gonna be noisy. I am actually interested to see what's inside of it, so let's check it out. And there's some screws here, so I, that's where I'm gonna start. There you go, look at this. That's what inside of this thing. This is like some kind of a metal, kind of like a spring, but a different spring kind of thing. So I guess I'm gonna just take it off. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, check this out. Oh my gosh, almost hit the camera and my face. All right, check this out. This is, oh, okay, I can take this off. Ah, oh man. Oh my goodness. Okay, so look at this. This is actually a very long spring. There you go. So what else do we have here? So I'm probably gonna snap these threads off. All right, there you go. Okay, I was just able to snap this top thing off and I can already see. It doesn't look like it's magnet actually. There you go. Ooh, look at this. There is this metal thing. So it's some kind of electrical thing, actually. I don't even know what is it. And this one you can only turn to one direction, actually. You can't turn it backwards. Only this direction. Like this. I'm just gonna use the axe to try to break this thing. Oops. There you go. Okay, I was able to break a little bit. There is a spring here. There is actually another spring inside. This is actually that red light. Okay, and inside you can see that red and black wires. That's basically what it's inside after we removed all these parts. It's interesting that there are two wires here, two red wires, and they were connected to this light. But there is no battery inside, so I'm not sure how it would work if there is no battery. And I'm assuming this thing doesn't require a lot of electricity at all. So maybe this was something has to do with the actual electricity. And this would be my question. If this thing would be flashing or blinking, what would be the source of the battery for this thing well anyways there it is i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't try this at home and i'll see you in the next video